How often do you make shrimp scampi at home? Seems like it's one of those things that you mostly get in restaurants, right? There's really no reason for it. It's super duper easy and full of delicious flavor. I've started off by squeezing a quarter cup of lemon juice for the sauce. One of the major flavorings in scampi is lemon juice and sometimes white wine, but I'm not using any white wine. Chop three cloves of garlic. Did you notice we're in a different kitchen today? We just wanted to change it up a little bit. What do you guys think? Our sauce ingredients are almost ready. All right, I'm almost done with my sauce ingredients, if you can believe it. It's that simple. To finish off, you're gonna wanna sprinkle with some parsley, so chop up a little bit of parsley. And then after that, it's a simple saute. All right, we're good. That's it, guys. So now what you wanna do is heat up a large pan, heating on medium-high heat. Add two tablespoons of olive oil. One, two. Turn it to high. Not too much, because you're gonna use butter later, so you just want enough fat that you can saute your shrimp in it. Add three quarters of a pound of peeled and deveined shrimp. It should take about three minutes for this to cook. I think my pan was just like one scotch, not hot enough. Should sizzle just a little more. Don't overcook your shrimp. You want them just opaque throughout. I have water boiling back here to cook my pasta, but it's an angel hair pasta that only takes like two or three minutes to cook, so I'm gonna wait until my sauce is done. So your shrimp don't overcook. Take them out of the pan. Reduce the heat to medium because you're gonna make a butter sauce. You don't want your butter burning. Add six tablespoons of butter, unsalted, and three cloves of minced garlic that I minced before. Cook it until the garlic is fragrant. That shouldn't take too long, two minutes maybe. In fact, it's already fragrant. I can smell it. It smells so good in here. I'm gonna turn it just up a tiny bit. I was a little worried that the butter was gonna burn in that really hot pan, but it seems to be doing okay. Then you add your quarter cup of lemon juice, and sometimes when you're adding liquid to fat, it can splatter a lot. It's not happening now, which is good. Butter already has plenty of moisture in it because it's not just 100% fat, so I think that might be helping. Season it with some salt. That's your sauce. Add your pasta now, angel hair. It's so thin, it really just takes minutes to cook and it's done. That's the great thing about angel hair. You gotta get it in there really fast so it doesn't stick together. Put it right into the sauce, put the shrimp back in, and then the parsley. And then dinner's done, you guys. That's fast, right? Like super fast and so easy to make at home. Buy a bag of frozen shrimp. You can have shrimp scampi whenever you want. Coat all your pasta in the sauce and serve it up. It's gonna be super great. It's delicious, it's super fast, and it's just like an Italian restaurant. Shrimp, scampi at home, 20 minutes start to finish, no problem, super delish, enjoy, enjoy. I'm eating with my fingers, mmm, scampalicious. guys, thanks for watching this video. Be sure to click here if you want to subscribe and click over here if you want to continue watching more great videos like this.